Hello, Pokemon Go fans. Yes, it's been a little while since we've spoken, you've talked, or done anything related to Pokemon Go. So, yeah, so let's go. just go through some of the news that's popping up from my new trainer friends that, I've, uh, that I'm picking up. Tomorrow is Tuesday. Do not forget, Tuesday from, uh, not, from 6 p.m. to 7 p.m., we have Drowsy tomorrow, okay? I managed to pick up Drowsy Shiny for the uh, uh, Kanto Tour celebration. And, of course, the bonus will be earned twice the XP for evolving a Pokemon, any Pokemon, not just Drowsy. So if, so if you've got something you want to evolve... Go ahead and throw on a lucky egg for this hour and start evolving. I may end up uh, doing a bunch of evolutions. Uh, maybe you'll see them in a video. I've got a few of them that I need Pokedex entries for. Uh, so, yeah, so there's that. And just released today, we have another incense day uh, with a research that I think you can uh, purchase for a dollar. Uh, so what, the last one was, what was the last one that we did? I don't remember, but man, I tell you what, if you don't have a shiny Beldum, this is gonna be your, or, or a good Beldum. I mean, uh, the last, uh, the last two events like this, I uh, think, what, Meowth, I got two Hundos, no shiny. Who was the last one? Who was the last one? Whoever the last one was, I mean, it was just insignificant, but I got two shinies for that, uh, for that incense event. So, yeah, so really good. Your, your chances of getting uh, a hundo or a, a shiny are really good for these, these uh, events here. So make sure that uh, you're going to be ready on March 14th from 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. Yes, it's a six-hour event. Um, I highly recommend getting the, um, purchasing the little ticket. Uh, it's, it's like a limited, it's a, well, obviously it's a limited research and it'll be catch 15, uh, of, uh, Beldums and catch, you know, like there'll be evolve one and stuff like that. And you will get, um, yeah, so there it is here. Uh, da, 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 da. During uh, da, da. an event exclusive, one Pokecoin bundle featuring an incense will also be available to purchase in the shop. Uh, so, yeah. So, yeah. So, make sure you have an incense on for this. And I think there will be some research that goes along with it. Uh, no, 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 no. Just reading here, reading here. Uh, you might uh, encounter Pokemon like a Alolan Diglett. Really, seriously? So there'll be other stuff going on. Oh, here's a breakdown of which Pokemon you can expect to encounter at different times throughout the event. Okay, so it's not just going to be uh, Beldum. So it's going to be a little bit of everything. So... Uh, from 11 a.m. to 12 p.m., you're going to catch Psychic type. Okay. Oh. Please say there's going to be Dragon type. Because I need, uh, well, I need Steel type for for the uh, the Mew, uh, Shiny Mew uh, quest. Uh, from 12 p.m. to 1 p.m., you'll have Steel type. I think I still need a few Steel type. 1 p.m. to 2 p.m., you'll have Psychic type, okay? Um, 2 p.m. to 3 p.m. will be another Steel type, okay, and then it just stacks over again. And then 3 p.m. to 4 p.m., Psychic type. 4 p.m. to 5 p.m. will be Steel type. So, Steel types, is that's that's when you want to get your Beldums in. So, yeah, so go ahead and look at that in your... Uh, and uh, set your calendars for that. That's awesome. That is going to be awesome. So, uh, how'd everybody do for uh, Fletchling Community Day, huh? I had to work. We were moving the, de the, uh, the department at work. So, 
Uh, I managed to put on the um, the gotcha. And between gotcha and going to the bathroom and really, you know, every once in a while sneaking my phone, I still managed 20 shinies. I managed 20 fletchling shinies. 20 fletchling shinies. And I, I did uh, evolve a few of them. I only evolved one shiny. That's all it was any good. But I managed to get my four, maybe even five uh, Talon Flames so I could get that uh, that Community Day move for it, the uh, Incinerate and Brave Bird. So, yeah. So, I managed to do that. So, how did everybody do? Let me know in the comments. Uh, and then, you know, the, the very next day, I get me a... I get me a shiny glammy out while I'm driving uh, home from work. And then I manage my first ever shiny totodile. Good God, man. Yes, indeed. Shiny totodile. Um, I did go to this community day, but I had no idea. A friend of mine says, dude, we got to go do the community day. I walked around in like a like a six foot circle, the entire event, you know, just talking and greeting with people, and I had no idea that 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 how to do a calm day. And back then, they were only three hours, so I had no idea. I was like, okay, so I didn't really grind as hard and whatever. But the very next one, oh, I tell you what, I went absolutely bonkers on. I think it was Swampert or something like that. I think I think so. I think it was Swampert. Anyway, um, yeah, so that is my first ever, and uh, I think it's been uh, available as a shiny, uh, when was that? I want to say 2018, so yeah, it's been oh. some time, and then right before the community day, <laughs> bing, woo, first ever shiny Voltorb, Voltorb's been available as a shiny since 2018. I want to say like August 2018 or something like that. Again, it's taken me so long to get some of these guys. There they are. Pokemon Go. Managed to get me another Eevee shiny. Yep. Got me a shiny Articuno during the uh, during those uh, r those few raid days. Where they had all the legendary birds out. And Mewtwo. So, yeah, so fantastic stuff, man. Uh, let's see, progress on the, here you go, I finished. Yeah, you can still see I need uh, two more fighting type. Wow, okay, I thought I was, I thought I was a little further back on that. Uh, rock type, six more of those. Uh, Fifteen more ice type, so I'm working on that. Ghost type, tw uh, twelve more. Five more steel type. Okay, so I, I could put on a uh, a Meltan box and, and wipe that out. It's the dragon ones. Look at that. Only two, and that was from catching Noibats. You know, I wish I would have been able to complete this, uh, this the at least to this point when the Kanto thing was going on, because Dratinis were popping up all over the place, and that would have helped. Uh, 30 dark type. Yeah, you can see I'm a little 19 away from that. So, I mean, that's only stage th stage 2. We have no idea. Well, I can because I watch the other videos, but keeping this suspense going. We have no idea what, what's, uh, what's on the end of, uh, of, uh, 3 and possibly even stage 4. Is stage 4 just gonna be like, like they normally do where it's just, you know, they throw out a bunch of, uh, bunch of rewards waiting on this three star i would do that uh that voltorb there but i don't know if i i don't know if i want to do a voltorb i probably will i probably will uh that's really about it i went on to a discord and i was able to pick me up um a few international friends so i've got this uh japanese a uh, friend. Uh, if they send you a gift, it tells you where the gift is coming from. 
So you can see Clo uh, Claudette. I haven't received a gift from her just yet. Uh, and then there's one from Germany. There's Italy. This one here, I'm not sure where she's from. Colombia. Chicago. Philippines. Another one from Chicago. Bavaria. Incredible. And then I got another Canadian friend. And I'm not sure where Small Dog is from. Then I got one from California, and then uh, that's, that's the rest. This is my friend from uh, China that uh, hasn't really, you know, been interacting with me as much. Uh, it's been a while since, uh, since we've exchanged gifts, so if you're watching, which I highly doubt, um... There you go. So yeah, so I went on. I just I just googled international friend codes for Pokemon Go, and you know I sent I sent a few. Uh, actually, I only sent like three requests, and apparently my name my name and trainer code went on to the server or the Discord server, and boom, people they they were, were requesting me, and I was like, shoot, I got nothing. Uh, I got nothing to lose. Yeah, go ahead. It's not like they can hack my account or anything. I'm just using a uh, friend code or something. So, so that was cool. So, yeah. So, there's Fletchling right there. So, yeah. So, I just put the gotcha on for Fletchling Tom Day. And, and it was it was awesome. Every time I'd turn around, I was like, oh, sh picked up three. Hey, picked up four. The first two hours were kind of slow. I was just like, you know, I kept having to check it. And was like, is this, are you sure this is working? I was sure this is working. And, uh, yeah, so, yep. So every once in a while, like I said, I'd sneak off to, hey, I'm going to go get something to drink. Or, hey, I'm going to go to the bathroom. And then I'd try to catch as many as I could. I think maybe I caught four or five actually myself. So, yeah, so it did really good. I love the gotcha. I've praised it all, all all too many times in my early videos. I highly recommend it. You can get them at GameStop. They're thirty five dollars. You can uh, you can uh, it is rechargeable, which is what I love about it. Whereas the Go Plus, um, the batteries run out. You got to go get new batteries, and they're those really flat, quarter sized uh, watch batteries. So. Those are like six or seven bucks a piece when now uh, when you gotta go buy those all the time. So uh so yeah, so you can, you can put the gotcha on to um spin the spinners. You can uh uh pick it uh select where you wanna catch Pokemon. You can turn off catch Pokemon, you can turn off you know, so if you just wanna spin spinners, that's cool too. If you want it, you know, so it has has um, well, you can depress the face of it, and you can select what you want to catch, what you don't want to catch. Um, it has a, it has a little bzzz, or you can turn off the bzzz, and then it just kind of, like, vibrates. Um, I have it where it hangs on, uh, where it, it's on a, uh, wristband, so they have them where you can put it on a key key fob but i find every once in a while because the wristband is kind of worn out um that it wants to pop out of there because it, it looks like a little it looks like a like a like a horse pill you know like a big giant tylenol so it's it's a little bitty and it pops out of the the wristband and it fits onto the little charger that uh, that comes with it and then usb you just hook it right into a you know, a little, little little charger cube, and uh, and go at it, man. And it's awesome. It's good for eight hours of play, and off and on. So I think I've stretched it out even more. And when I'm in a car, I just dangle it from the uh, turn signal uh, uh, n uh, knob, and that way I don't have to have it on me. I just get in the car and sync it to my to my phone, and bing, there we go. So yeah. I like catching drillbers. I definitely need the XL candy for it and stuff like that. So, so that's what's going on in Pokemon Go. I mean, I was I was gonna do a couple of evolutions. Uh, I've been seeing a lot of Frokies around. I'm seeing a lot of Frokies around, but 
None of them have been that great. Did a uh, magna magneton raid earlier today. Could have been a shun. Could have been a hundo. Sorry. Yeah. Well, it could have been a shundo too. Uh, but yeah, that was uh, that was kind of nice. I've uh, done a couple of tornadoes. Hatched another emolga out of a 10-kilometer egg. This one wasn't that bad. Look at that. Pretty good. So, yeah. So, seeing a lot of low tads. You know I love to catch low tad. Uh, frillish. Have you gotten your frillish yet? This is only the second one that I've seen. Um, it used to be a reward uh, once you reached uh, level 20. And uh, go battle league, but uh, now all of a sudden uh, I don't know if it's for this event or or for whatever. But um, yeah, so they're popping up uh, usually around when you're around like bodies of water or the river or something like that. Because that's what I do as I drive. Uh, I drive the river road so uh, to and from work. So if you're around large bodies of water, but I've seen on some of the videos uh, where they're shoot. You know, especially in Australia, I mean, she's not even near water, and she's uh, she's catching these things left and right. So that is frillish. That's the female version. I think you get the male the male version in Go Battle League still. So, yep, and it does have an evolution. Uh, you can see. I mean, I've only caught two of these things, so uh, three candy a piece, and I don't even want, I don't even want to risk. Because I think the first one uh, jumped out of the ball a couple of times. I don't want to even risk trying to get extra candy on it just yet until I can until I can make sure I get a couple of them. Uh, deerlings have been popping up. This is the uh, the new seasonal deerling. Remember, but there's four of them for each each one of the seasons. So this is the I will do an evolution tomorrow because you can see my little shadow down there on the evolve. I uh, have not evolved that particular one yet. So there it is. So yes, yeah, so there's my Talon Flames. One, two, three, four. I only did four of them, but you get the... Uh... Which one was the Community Day move? Fl I think Flame Charge was the Community Day move. Let's see. Yeah, Flame Charge. Um, I don't know for what happens. I don't know if it was a glitch or something like that. But I evolved these. This one, like, maybe 10 minutes after the event ended. And I did not get the, uh, that, that charge move. I thought ap you had two hours after, after the calm day to get the, uh, get the move. And, well, I didn't get it, so... I have Brave Bird on that. Of course, I could TM it away, you know, an elite TM, but I don't want to waste it on that. We'll find out how good it is in uh, in uh, battling or anything like that. I stuck mine in a gym one time just to kind of, hey, look what, look what I got. But other than that, that's that's been about it. So, all right. I have a couple of new trainers. And uh, just remember to be patient. I keep inviting these uh, these these uh, trainers to uh, to raids, and they're just like they're rushing their throws. You, there's no need to rush your throws. Uh, yes, you have uh, have limited uh, supply of pokeballs, but there's no time limit. There's no time limit to catching these things. Okay, so take your time. Um, yeah, let's... Oh, I don't want to catch the doof. All right, so that's all you're going to do. All right, he's, he's a little bit bigger CP. Do a little basic training here. I'm sorry, folks. Um, so there you go. So he's, he's ready. Okay, you can size his circle down if you want. You just depress the ball. And then when you get it, boom, right there. Okay? Now, it's a lot different on a raid boss, but, I mean, uh, let's see if we can uh, nail that excellent on him. So, we wait for the attack. That's the attack. And, boom, and then just, just kind of lightly. You don't have to throw it like you're 
trying to throw through, I mean, I got friends that are like, whoa, man, he's a, you know, and they're like, whoa, and it, you know, it's like, come on, man, you, you know, yeah, you don't need to do that, you don't need to do that, I mean, I've seen him, and he's like, like, whoa, he's like throwing for the fences, I'm like, no, man, you don't need to do that, just kind of a little flick, just a little, little swish and flick, okay, so, um, let's see what we got going on. You know what? Just for a little quick content, let me let me just uh, if you've never seen Voltorb in a uh, in a raid, so let's go. At the, I have no, I haven't seen this, or well, I've never done one anyway. Let's see if any of the fam is on. Let's see. Let's let's just send out some invites, you know, because I know they don't they don't have him. It's an excellent chance to get the shiny. The uh, raid bosses, if they can be shiny, have a 1 in 25 chances of being shiny. And then you're usually going to get one uh, with pretty decent stats. Or IVs, you know, you know what I meant. You watch my videos. Now, let's see if anybody shows up. In fact, let's see if we can't get an international friend here. Does anybody have their little icon on? Yeah, let's see if Vic in Canada wants to join a Unite, uh, USA. Nobody really wants that. They're probably saving all of their... Raid passes for Tornadus. Tomorrow is Tuesday, so we have Spotlight Hour, 6 p.m. to 7 p.m. And then Wednesday is Raid Night, also from 6 p.m. to 7 p.m. your local time. And I hope hope we can get some uh, some Tornadus raids in there. I really would like the shiny. I did not get a shiny Landorus when he was here. So, yeah, hoping for some, uh, some shiny available for Tornadus. And then, uh, and out of the legendary birds, the only shiny I don't have still is Zapdos. Zapdos. All right, so here he is. He'll go down pretty easy. I was actually putting up a fight for a one star. There he is. Okay. Boom. Okay. Down goes Voltorb. You gotta say it. Gotta say it. I've gotta say it. All right. Yay, we win. Yay, what did we win? Oh, okay. We got some of those. We got some of those. We got a rare candy, cool, 1,000 Stardust, 3,500 XP. Okay, 16 opportunities to catch it. All right, and it is not shiny. It is a 561. All right, so what we're going to do is this is what you would do for all of your raid bosses, so I'm going to continue to do it. Just use your best berry, which is the golden raspberry. Okay. Wait for it to pop up, up under the CP over there. That's how you know he's gotten it. Okay, so we're going to tap the ball till we get that little bitty circle there. And we're going to wait for the attack. Remember, we have all day. He can sit there and stare at us all he wants. We're going to wait for the attack. That is the attack. And whoops, wow. That went really wrong. Well, he's a one star. He wasn't going to put up much of a fight. So there it is. Okay. Making progress towards our win so many raids. See, that is just awful. For me, for you, it might be something fantastic. But I do have a hundo of the Voltorb, so... And he's not really relevant for battling or anything like that for me. For me. I'm a level 43 trainer. I've got so much better in the electric uh, uh, department 
for Pokemon. So I do not need him, but hey, that could be good for you, especially if you get a uh, one with better stats than that in my eyes. Uh, so there you go. So, like I said, I'm making. Oh, hey, let's go. Ahead. I am working on best friends with my buddy Melmetal. Okay. So this is the first gift. We're finally, I think, good friends. Where are you, dude? All right. This is his first gift to me. Sorry. I'm going to back up. Gee whiz, I've never seen him this close. Take picture. Hey, look at that. We got a, uh, a photo bomb with, with our buddy there. Hello. Okay. Oh, yeah, I've got a task for... Okay, are you walking with us? Cool. I don't know if I did this yet today or not. There you go. Cool. Four, four. All right, sweet. And then we'll do a quick battle with him. Nope, there you go. Five stars. Cool. I love it. I love it. There he is. Schmeargle. Two. Alright, so there we go. We put the berry out. Okay. That's the attack. Excellent shot. See? We're just lobbing it out there. We're not chucking it for the fence. Okay, use three berries. Is this Smeargle any good? I, out of all of the Smeargles, I've, I don't have one that's halfway decent. You know, just for, just for S and G, to you know, power him up or anything like that. Say seven twenty. So I'm gonna put on, and just lob it on over. We're not throwing for the fences here. Some of the raid bosses, yes, they can uh, they can be a little far back, but if you just take your time and size your throws, you should have pretty good success. Nope, 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 dealing. Okay, uh, just shiny check. Nope, no shinies for you. All right. So, there's my buddy. Okay, let's go and claim these rewards real quick, and then I will sign off. Thank you all for watching and subscribing. There's Ducklet. All right. 356. He's out of a research, so he, he cannot run away. And let's try to get some extra candy out of him, I guess. Okay, again, just wait for that circle to uh this is the other way to do it you can just hold on to the ball and spin it spin it spin it and wait for that circle to go down i don't recommend doing that for a raid boss because they're they're going to jump no good for me not to mention i'm not going to be fighting with a ducklet or a swana at all Plenty better uh, stuff to deal with. Okay. And there's a Tranquil. Which I really don't feel like doing. But I'm going to see off camera if my nephew wants to do that just because he likes raiding. And this is what else I wanted to show you. Remember you have a metal that you need to work on. So it's a... Uh, I'm up to the uh, silver part, which is uh, win a thousand raids. Okay. And then there's the other part. Is this it? Yes. This is why I like to invite as many friends to any raid. One star, three star, five star, doesn't matter. This is why I try to invite everybody. Because I want to win 1,000 raids with a friend or friends, plural. Okay? This is why I try to invite y'all. 
you all have access to this too. And, uh, you know, by me inviting you and you fighting with me, it's a win-win for both of us. So there you go. So working on my platinum medal, I need... Yeah, I could probably knock this out with uh, this new, this upcoming Beldum incense event or just putting on a Meltan box and I'll have that 2500 and my platinum badge there. Still working on my fairy badge. And, of course, you can see how difficult it is to find dragon types for me. Anyway. All right, folks. I thank y'all very much liking and subscribing. Um, yes, I'm going to have a challenge video coming up for you uh, here soon. I do have two elite trainer boxes of... Well, you'll just wait for the, uh, the video. And uh, yeah, so we're going to go big. We're going to go big, folks. We are going to go big. Uh, yep, we're gonna go big on this one. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna expect at least 50 subscribe, uh, up to 50 subscribers, you know, you'll see, we'll make a, we'll make a big deal out of it, so anyway. All right, folks, once again, I thank y'all very much, liking and subscribing, and apparently you can share these things, so share it around, share it around. Spread the joy. Pokemon Go, what a fantastic game. What a better time. It is no better time to be playing this game than, than now, you know. So, you can't get out. You can't go rat the streets. You can't really do this. Go ahead. Sit down. Catch some Pokemon. I'll see you in the next one. Kid Eric is out.